I didn't know anything about the Boston Strangler case uh, before I got this script. I had a, a vague, a vaguely heard of it, but really didn't know anything at all. So um, I think uh, it's such a complicated case. Uh, the reason I wanted to do it was I, I thought it was fascinating that it was two women who highlighted uh, the case in the first place and then the problems within uh, the reporting of it um, and and the police work that went into it. So I felt like it was a very important story to tell. I felt like it really highlighted the importance of female investigative journalists um, and it really highlighted the importance of having women in positions of power as far as storytelling went. I think their resilience was extraordinary. I think what they were up against as far as uh, being taken seriously in a male dominated world, uh, in a male dominated industry, um, going up against the Boston Police Department, um, uh, and, and plus reporting on a, a serial killer or multiple killers that were not caught. Um, so I think the fact that they put themselves in harm's way, um, they did get a lot of death threats. Uh, you know, they, they, it did impact their family life. And the fact that they did all of this when they had children and they still had to be present as mothers. Um, the, you know, I, I thought that they were incredibly impressive women. Um, and I felt like it was very important to tell their story. I think it's very important to highlight the, the job of female investigative journalists because they chose this story. They knew that it was important and it had been largely uh, ignored. Um, and so, so yeah, so I, I felt it was, a, it was a very empowering and quite cathartic uh, experience to play uh, Loretta McLaughlin.